And Jesus said, I will give you the keys to the kingdom. One of those keys is prayer. Our greatest defense is in prayer. We have to stop fighting battles in the flesh and take the position of advantage and victory, which is in the spirit. Some prayer, some power. More prayer, more power. Much prayer, much power. I sever every cord designed by the enemy to strangle you out of your blessing, miracle, and financial breakthrough in the name of Jesus. I speak to every area of sickness, disease, and infirmity in your body and command it to be burned by the fire of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus. I speak light into your darkness, soundness, into your mind, righteousness into your spirit, and healing into your body in the name of Jesus. I command every arrow of the enemy that is targeting your body, your household, and the fulfillment of your destiny to be dismantled in the name of Jesus. By divine authority, I command every demonic trap that has been designed to catch you into a snare to be uncovered in the name of Jesus. Lord, keep us hidden from fatal targets of our enemies. May I never be uncovered from your hedge of protection in the the name of Jesus. I rebuke and cast out every vampire, incubus, succubus, and pestilent spirit that has taken residency in your body and in your home in the name of Jesus. I seal every breach of your life that has opened the door to demonic influence, oppression, and possession in the name of Jesus. I decree and declare that today is a day of peace, mercy, grace, love, joy, hope, faith, fulfillment, completion, and success in the name of Jesus. Dear Lord, rescue us out of our mess. Dispatch an angel to us and don't delay doing what's promised. If you don't do it, it cannot be done. Dear Lord, line up what's out of tune. Let people see you when we enter the room and remind us that time is winding up because you're coming soon. Dear Lord, get perverted thoughts, lust, greed, bad attitudes, and ungodly secrets out of us. Let us consider your feelings towards sin in the name of Jesus. Dear Lord, shut the mouth of every naysayer, witch, warlock, and backbiter. Raise up a group of people who will desire to be your mouthpiece in the earth in the name of Jesus. Dear Lord, help us to make giant steps. Make our ideas fly. Push us to run after visions that you gave us and make the enemy crawl in the name of Jesus. Dear Lord, mold us in your hands. Give a touch up in areas where we're struggling. Erase what isn't like you and unveil us for your glory in the name of Jesus. I command every spirit of gluttony, sugar addiction, overindulgence, compulsion, addiction, craving, lack of self-control, anxiety, depression, anger, unworthiness, unbelief, oppression, self-hatred, rejection, rebellion, inconsistency, deception, failure, fear, intimidation, and every other spirit connected and related that is not of the Lord to come out now in the name of Jesus and by the blood of Jesus Christ you are not allowed to dwell in, round, or attached to us in any way in the name of Jesus. My body is whole and healthy mentally, spiritually, and emotionally on a level of maximum efficiency. I'm not moved by what I see. Faith is the substance of things hoped for but not yet seen. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. I command every issue, metabolism, bandier, blood sugar, respiratory, cardiovascular, digestive, neuromuscular, all other systems of my body, every cell, every organ, function as they were created to in perfect harmony and balance in the name of Jesus. Walk in the wholeness of Jesus Christ. I have outward and inward beauty. The beauty of Christ radiates from my very presence. The Jesus that is in me, beautiful. And the fragrance of the Lord follows me wherever I go. I am the bride of Christ, her blameless before him. Every situation and circumstance, Jesus has plans and a hope for my future. And I will fulfill all that he has for me in favor of the Lord rests upon me. I run the race with a victorious crown on my head and feet that are swift to reach the high calling that God has placed upon my life. Call it done and it is so. In the matchless name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, amen.